I have the honor of representing Franklin D. Roosevelt for Freedom Spark. Thank you to the NYPD for joining us today and for their beautiful performance, as well as to the leadership of For Freedom Spark Conservancy who make today's ceremony possible. Sally Menard, the president, William J. Mandan, Google founder and chair emeritus, Ms. Franklin D. Roosevelt, Jr. Honorary Chair, Barbara Shattuck, the con, the chair, and William R. Griffith, secretary and treasurer. Freedom is not free. And we continue to strive to attain the four freedoms set forth by President Franklin D. Roosevelt. The first is freedom of speech and expression everywhere in the world. The second is freedom of every person to worship God in his or her own way, everywhere in the world. The third is freedom from wants, everywhere in the world. The fourth is freedom from fear, which means a worldwide reduction in armaments to such a point and in such a thorough fashion that no nation will be in a position to commit an act of physical aggression against any neighbor anywhere in the world. That is no vision of a destined millennium. It is a definite basis for a kind of world attainable in our own time and generation. I hope, perhaps selfishly, that these freedoms can be attained now in our generation. Today, we remember the more than one million men and women who died in our armed forces to protect our freedom. Tomorrow, I yearn, as generations before me have, for a future. A future where freedom from fear has been attained in our generation. When as prayed for a millennium ago in Isaiah, nation shall not lift up sword against nation, neither shall they learn war anymore. You may please join me in a moment of silence. I now have the honor of joining Mr. Rodriguez, who has served two tours in Iraq, an honored veteran in laying a wreath. <laughs> Thank you.